David Essel, once again, reporting live from Shark Valley. Last night, the government tried to shut this operation down. Its fear is that too few people would visit the island of Sanibel. And so they sent a SWAT team. And when a house was surrounded and they knocked on the door and I saw what was going on, I immediately did what any really good reporter does. I switched to a powerful Spanish accent. And they said, are you David Essel? I said, oh no, senor. Me no speak English, eh? And with that, they left. And I heard as they walked away, someone saying, who the hell gave us this address? It's one of the many tricks of the trade, but I'm gonna show you right now what's happened in this area. You will notice home after home that is vacant. What used to be a highly populated, fun, resident and tourist attraction has turned into 100% vacancy. But that's not all. You see the churning waters behind me. We have further proof of what happens. Now, once again, what you're about to see is not for the average American. If you haven't eaten in a while, you're in a good space. If you have, I would blind your eyes because what I'm about to show you has never been seen. It's the remnants, the actual remnants of the last person walking Shark Valley Beach yesterday. Now, if you're strong enough, you may observe. Look, look at what we are, look at the final expression, the final expression just before they were taken in Shark Valley. Do you need any more proof than that? I think not. One of our young viewers wrote in the other day and said, could this be Sharknado 6? And young lady, we have one answer for you. This is Sharknado 1 million. Reporting live from Shark Valley, I'm David Essel.